Assalamu alaikum dear students and welcome back to Bioinformatics with MK. Today we discuss that how we predict two d structure of protein mean secondary structure of protein. So the secondary structure of protein is also called two d structure of protein. This structure we can predict in the different server like Cypred and SOPMA. But today this video is about SOPMA that how we predict SOPMA servers of protein structure. So as you know the SOPMA server is online server as we can search and online through Google the SOPMA server. The SOPMA server is online so resources that we can predict the 2D structure of protein with their percentages mean that how percent helix present how percent stand these are things present so we can see in the SOPMA server result. Now this is the first thing that we can here click on the SOPMA secondary structure prediction. This is the main page of SOPMA secondary structure server of methods here you can write your protein name sequence name optional after that you copy your protein sequence and paste here these parameters you can leave as the uh, parameter is default if you want change so you can change anything from here and also from 3 helix sheet if you want if you want a 4 helix sheet so you can uh, change from here after that nothing to be changed and click on the submit for your result now these are the results of your SOPMA server for 2D structure of protein so you can see here the SOPMA result is of our trim 35 protein if you seen this sequence this sequence is from your protein sequence which is present by different things like if you see the blue color it show us to do helix and more color I show the many thing and here we can discuss if you here you can see the alpha helix is 319 mean that 46 percent helix present in our protein then we talking about the pi helix is present 0% beta bridges is also 0% extend stand is present 68 9% is can show 9.93% near to 4 not 10% then the beta run is also 29% and which 29 uh, amino acids and show 4% then beta region is 0 and random coil is present 269 which has 39.27 percentages and all the thing, other thing is 0. So you can uh, write your result from here that our protein present helix is 46 percent, coil is present 39 percent and 9 percent is extended stand. So this thing you can write your, your result in your paper or public um, articles this is a R assignment anything else here you can see this crop which you need to capture from here and paste your paper or thesis this graphic is represent also different thing I told you that our protein have 46 percent helix which has shown in the blue color so you can see this blue color is higher and then the other because the most of thing and most of helix present in our protein then the different color thing is shown in the different things like random coil extended stand and beta bridges after that if you're talking about a parameter so we lived and the, the parameter in the default system as well you can change from the starting of your segment sequence so our parameter when it is 17 percent similarity threshold value is 8 and number of state is 4 so this is the 2d structure of your protein sequence and all above of the SOPMA server I hope you like this video subscribe my channel for more video of bioinformatics and English